What's up ladies and gentlemen and welcome back to Terraria Gary's World and Let's Play and it's still night time. We still haven't been attacked yet at all by anything. So I'm starting to think that the evil presence watching us isn't watching us or isn't going to attack tonight because normally that means I Cthulhu. But this is like the second time it's happened and still haven't got been attacked yet. So I do not know what the go is there. I I'm really confused to be honest. But look. All things considered, we are getting ready to tackle our first boss. We're almost at full health, which that's the main thing that we need to focus on, I think, is getting full health. But we're almost at full health, and otherwise we're doing pretty well, to be honest. We've got a small little base arena open here, which I, I think I need to finish. That's probably a good thing to do this episode, is finish that. But otherwise, then we start slaying some bosses. Oh my god, we got a zombie banner. That's great. So look how, look how we're shredding. We're absolutely shredding zombies with this thing. Let's, eh, 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 eh. can I place you please? Let me place you. I can't place you on this. Well, that's annoying. Let me, let me uh, click that there. And zombie banner. Yay. Now, see, we're one shot on zombies now. This is epic. Okay. So, we need to finish this off. I might start doing that now. Because it's night time. We can fight some zombies. We're not really getting anything from it. But like, a bit of money never hurt. A bit of money never hurt. Oh god, I fell. And then we need to do some more exploring. Now, for some easy and quick hearts, I'm half tempted to go back into the crimson. God damn it, I keep stuffing this up. I might go back to the crimson. Now, the reason why I want to do that is because there's usually some hearts and stuff in there. And I don't think I broke any orbs last ep last let's play. So we could probably break some uh, break some orbs. That might not be a bad idea to be honest. Hmm, I think that'd be a good idea. I'm also probably gonna make this longer. I feel like this needs to be longer. It, it needs to be longer than this. And we're gonna need honey too. I reckon that's good enough. That's probably long enough. So I'm gonna keep my banner there just because I want my banner there. <laughs> they can't get me. You guys suck. So close to getting me though, like seriously. It's so close. Bang! Two shots and we kill two zombies. That's freaking epic. Okay, so did let's see where there's corruption on our map. We know we've got corruption here. This is the corruption that we've been into slightly. We haven't destroyed any of the orbs. So, yeah, let's let's destroy some orbs. Do we have any more corruption over this way? No, we do have some kind of pit there, though. That's kind of cool. And then that's that's about it. That's really about it. <gasps> Ooh, we could go back and tackle the snow. Now that we can actually fend for ourselves, that might not be a bad idea. But, you know what? First of all, we're going to run straight over this way. We're going to go to the Crimson. We're going to go down there, and we're going to break some orbs. I might actually go talk to the demolitionist, which, let me see where he is on the map. Where's the demolitionist? He's he's on our way over this way anyway. Okay, that's good. So we're going to go talk to the demolitionist, grab some bombs, some bombalicious bombs, so we can um, attack these orbs, because the idea is we're going to smash two orbs. That won't be enough to summon the boss, because if we do three, that'll summon the boss. And we really don't want that, to be honest. We just don't. Um, how much does this cost? Oh, well, that's probably enough, and I'll, like, grab 10 dynamite, let's just say. That, that's more than enough, but it's always good to have some bombs. Let's just mark all these safe as well. Um, but yeah, so if we smash three of those orbs, we're going to summon the boss. The boss for the Crimson is the um, Brain of Cthulhu. Now, he's going to be pretty difficult for us to fight. We're definitely going to need max health, and we're going to need some better armor. Because our, our current armor is pretty average at best. So we're probably going to need some half-decent armor, which I'll look into that. that. That'll be something that we need to look into as well. Um, so we're going to need a bit of that to fight him, and we're going to have to open up this whole area in there. So we might even start preparing that to, to fight that, because he'll be our one of our first bosses. I think I want to tackle the Isle of Cthulhu first, though. Now, the reason why I want to do that, for those of you who don't know who the Isle of Cthulhu is, he's, he's basically like a little eye monster that comes after us. Anyway, I keep thinking he's going to attack us when I see that message at the end of the episodes because it's like the third time now it's popped up. Also, is that a random cactus? That is random cactus. Okay, you get out of here. No one likes you. Eh! Eh! Damn it! Eh! Okay, oh, yeah. got it. First try. Um, let's get rid of Captain. Oh, God! Oh, I lost so much health there. Oh! I, I kept jumping on cactus there. What the? Where did I put cactus here? Ow. Okay. Y'all being rude. Let me heal. Let's kill you two. You suck. And you. That is the only sucky thing about this weapon. You kind of really need to be close up to do decent damage. And also make sure you hits land. 
Because, ah, why is there a jungle bat? Why am I missing this jungle bat every, with every shot? Jungle bat. Oh, ah. Haha. Kill the jungle bat. God, this is us attacking everything. Okay, so where are some of these orbs? I think there's some down here. So we're going to go down. Oh, God. Another one of you. I don't want to jump down there with one of yous. You will end me. I also got to... Oh, actually. Ooh, that'd be another good thing that we need to look into. I'm also starting to lose some health pretty quickly here. Okay, let's drop some bombs in. And we'll probably drop three. That, that should actually do it and probably blow it up too. Yeah, it did. <gasps> awesome. So we just got the Hurtful Undertaker. So, sweet. That is one of the better items that we can get here. And, oh my god. A horrible chill goes down our spine. I just realized there's a whole thing here. I can't mind this, can I? Um, sticky dynamite. Oh, sticky bombs. Bang. That's just a granite bomb. Oh, yes. Ah, oh, crystal too. I didn't even realize that. Sweet. There is a granite biome here. I can't remember if I've seen this. I don't think I have, to be honest. I didn't know there was a granite biome here. This is, this is good, though. Okay, because that means we're going to get this heart crystal. It's also underwater. So it's kind of annoying, but that's fine. Um, let's... Why do I keep sucking with my aim with this thing? Ah, oh, life crystal. Beautiful. But yeah, that is another thing that we can look into. Wow, this is a tiny biome. This, this really had nothing in it. The next thing we can look into as well is, um, sky, um, sky islands. Now, sky islands are literally islands in the sky, as their name suggests. And they house some really cool items that we will really want, to be honest. That will be quite useful for us. Especially with the way I play, which is terribly. Um, because one of the items we can get is a Lucky Horseshoe. I think I mentioned it last episode as well. Now, the Lucky Horseshoe, that's essentially going to stop fall damage. So, they're all the things that we kind of need to get done. Um, maybe not exactly in this part, but overall need to get done. So, I think that's what our aim is going to be. So, today we're going to smash these orbs and fight these granite guys because they're strong as fuck. Ow, ow. Okay, they're going to kill me here. Hup, hup. I need to get out of here. Get you out of my way. And you. Ah, don't kill me. Ah. I keep forgetting how much health I have now. I actually have a lot more health than I thought. But uh, yeah, we're going to smash these. Another one of those. Probably that one there, I reckon. We'll smash that. See what items that we get. And then... Yeah. We might try and go for a Skyland if we've got um, gravity potions. So we've got the gravity potions. We can hopefully get um, a Skyland nice and quick. Also, these these granite guys are kind of annoying. Can I... Oh, let's try and... Oh, almost got him. Oh, there we go. We killed the bat. Alright, so we got what we wanted out of there. And then some. We also got the Undertaker. We should try out the Undertaker. So we got the Hurtful Undertaker. So this is a pistol. It's um right in line with our class. We can't shoot it very quick. Also, can't hold it down, which kind of sucks. But it does some decent damage. I think 17 range damage. So it's not, not bad. Not as good. Oh, actually, it's one better than our Boomstick. Problem is, this only fires once. The Boomstick has a chance to hit multiple times. So, like, if we use it on this guy here. Like, bang, bang. It does do some pretty good damage. This is also doing 24 damage. 27! Whew! We got the plus 13 damage. It does well. Oh, God. Oh, this is the wrong item. <laughs> but our Boomstick is definitely going to be a, our, our superior weapon. Especially when it comes to knockback. Oh, my God. Knockback is great. Oh, let me grab that vertebra. Okay. So, let's go knock down this next orb. And get this out of the way. And then we're going to stop. Oh! Wow! Speaking of gravitational potions, apparently we got one from some of those things, uh, some of those, uh, orbs. So I think we'll do that next. Ooh, what do we get? Is that a light, crimson heart? Oh, sums a heart to provide light. Oh, well, that's better. That gives us some light. I mean, it's not great, but it's better than nothing. Screams echo around you. Yeah, we're starting to get into the serious stuff. So the next one that we kill will spawn the boss, but we ain't prepared for that. So that ain't happening this episode. But what I might do, I'm going to keep just having a look around, just see if I can find some hearts while we wait for night time. Oh, this one's out in the open. This is weird. Um, so yeah, I'm going to keep having a quick look around to see what we can find. But otherwise, I'll wait for daytime, and then we'll go searching for a Sky Island. See what we can get out of Sky Island. So, I'll reconvene once it's daytime. Okay, so I'm not too far away from where we were, and I've already found a chest... This chest does look a bit odd on its own, though, so I'm just going to really quickly check. Okay, there's no dynamite around here. Okay, I'm just going to open it. 
Cool. Ah, awesome. So we got another gravitational potion, which will be useful. We also got a suspicious looking eye and a wild cloud in the bottle. No, a quick one's better. So, A, again, we can use that uh, cloud, uh, not cloud in the bottle. We can use that uh, gravitational potion to help look for those skylines. But then also, um, another thing that's going to be useful is that uh, suspicious looking eye. So we can use that when we're ready to summon the eye of Cthulhu instead of waiting for him to show up. Because otherwise, there's no other way to do it. So we're going to keep that handy. Otherwise, I'm just going to keep exploring. Hopefully, we'll find a heart crystal. Fingers crossed. A few moments later. Ah, oh, man, this is this is really our episode today. Literally just over there was where our chest was. And right down here, there's a heart crystal. How good. Ow! Stop hurting me. And apparently two stacks of mother slimes. I also just realized we obviously came very close to here. Because as you can see over there, we got torches and everything. So we actually real nil really came close to this but without seeing it. But bam, that's another life crystal. We literally need one more to get max health. So that's awesome. But uh, otherwise, I'm going to keep going. And waiting for that daytime to come. And killing this salamander. For no reason. Yeah. Alrighty. So, it is daytime. Now, finally. So, we are going to go searching. Oh, God. I got a Spelunker potion. Man, every today is like potion day. Alright. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to suck down one of these gravitational potions. And then we're going to start swip flip-flopping around. So, I'm going to need the map open for this. I just realized. Ah. Uh, oh, no. I could die now. Okay. Now, see, I need this map open to see where I've gone, if that makes sense. See how we're traveling into outer space? It's epic. So, we want to do this to try and cover as much ground as we can. Now, we've got enough time, so we should be able to actually cover the whole map pretty quickly. And pretty easily, because it's a small world. But, um, I'm hoping for a sky island somewhere around here that has a lucky horseshoe. Because if it has that lucky horseshoe, we no, no longer need to worry about fall damage. And that... That oh see there you go here it is here's a sky island this might be okay so this is a sky island but this is ah oh, freaking harpies we're gonna run away from this harpy because that harpy will mess us up um but yeah this sky island that you see here is actually just for fishing so this actually isn't a good sky island that's not gonna have any chests on it oh we also got the harpy brigade following us apparently it's okay we should be good. Hopefully we find some other ones. Oh god, we're running into them. Uh, stay away from me, harpies. <laughs> They're gonna kill me. Ow. They actually might kill me. That's, this is a slight worry. Uh, I need to stay away from them. Uh, this is this is bad. We got all the harpies following us right now. Oh my god. I might die. Thankfully we have two. Uh, they're just they're quicker than me. That's the problem. Uh, stay away. I really need to have this out. Ugh, I'm still searching for the... Oh, God! Stay away from me! Ugh. Stay away! Ah, they're gonna kill me! They're gonna kill me! Oh, I found another one! Maybe. Yes. Yes, I have. No, that one's gonna kill me. No! Oh, God damn it! Ugh. Well, we found another one. That's, that's at least positive. But, man, these harpies are gonna mess us up. Fingers crossed it's in there. Okay, so we're, we're basically... Ow! Ow! Oh, we're basically getting decimated by piranhas. Jesus. Piranhas are evil. Um, but we're basically underneath the Sky Island here. It's just over here. Hup, hup, hup. God, okay, change. I'm gonna get attacked by harpies again. I can feel it. Um, oh my god, that was a terrible chest. All we got was a shiny red balloon. That honestly sucks. Oh, man, these harpies are so strong. How much hit points do they have? 300. Stay away, harpy. Okay, yeah, they're not as strong as I thought. They do shoot, though. I want to try and run away from them as quickly as I can. Oh, they did drop feathers, though. I mean, I don't know what I can use feathers for right now, but they are useful for later on in the game. <gasps> Thank you, you dropped health. Okay, we're going to continue over this way because I feel like there is a still a chance that we can have more skylines over this way. So let's jump off and continue this way. However, I don't know if we'll find any more along this way at the moment. And that's okay. So we still got to search the other side of the map as well. That one had literally nothing good in it. The two things that we're looking for, Star Fury, which we can't really use, but it is kind of cool because it shoots stars, I guess. So it's, it's cool. That'd be one thing. That'd be really cool to have. Um, the other thing is, uh, oh God, we're falling into the ocean. 
Let's go back home. The other cool thing that we could get is, um... Okay, cool. We're in the right area. The other cool thing that we could get is actually, um... The horseshoe that we need. So, there's not really much else that we're after. <gasps> Sky Island. Hello, hello. Please have the goods. Please have what I need. If you don't, I will cry. Oh, well, hey, we got the stuff, Yuri. I mean, we can't really use it because we're going for a ranger class, but I guess at least we got a stuff, Yuri. That's at least something, but let me show you this thing. This thing is epic. Like, not gonna lie. See, we can, we can use it to attack these harpies. Look at the stars flying down. Look at the stars. Okay, it's hard to aim it, but you know, the stars are cool. I'm just gonna keep aiming it at them. Hopefully, hopefully it kills them or it keeps them away from us. Actually, they're not following us as quickly this time. That's that's actually kind of kind of helpful. But we really need to find one with it. If we don't, then this let's play has gotten a lot harder, and we might have to steal it from another world. Ow! 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 They came back with a vengeance. Oh, stay away from me! Oh God! They're catching up to me. Ah! Ah! Why can't I hit them? I have the worst aim in the world with this thing. Okay, I got a few hits in there. It's because, oh god, oh god, oh, there's another one. Ah, 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 please don't kill me. Please don't kill me. Ah, let's attack. You know what, let's, let's swap to our actual gun. God. Oh, if this doesn't have a freaking lucky horseshoe, I'm gonna cry. Three, two, one. Oh, thank god, okay. Woo! Okay, we got our lucky horseshoe. Perfect! Oh, this episode's great. We're gonna swap that out. We don't need flippers on. Let's be real. Flippers? Who cares? I have no health right now. Oh my god. I really need to, like, heal up something chronic. But these guys are probably gonna kill me, so let's... I, I really want to kind of show it off, though. I want to show us off not dying from falling. But I can't really kill them, so let's just try and run. Huh. Oh no! It's run out anyway. Oh well. See? Watch... Oh. Of course I fall into water. Of course. Well, that actually kind of works out, to be honest. Let's find a spot where I would lose health on and jump off. Oh, God. Okay, we got everything covered for us. Ow! Ow! D don't tell me we're going to die from a slap. Yeah, okay, we got destroyed there. There is ten... Nope. That's ten silver coins. There's one gold coin. Okay, we don't need to care about that. Alrighty. Perfect. So, let's try and mimic some fall damage. Let's try and just get to a spot maybe... We might lose full full damage from jumping from here. Let's let's see. Let's take it off for a second. Okay, let's put it there. Let's see if we lose health by jumping. Yeah, boom. Okay, see, we lost five health there. Now, <laughs> let me equip my lucky horseshoe, and then we shall do the same thing. Jump off and bam, no full damage taken. How epic! So honestly, I think we've done well this episode. To be perfectly honest. It was a bit of bit of upgrades, but the lucky horseshoe was definitely the highlight so far. So hopefully next time we can get our health and fight our first boss. I think that's going to be the plan for the next episode is fight our first boss. So I think we can take on Naya Cthulhu with the items that we've gotten today and the fact that we got our lucky horseshoe. Plus, if we fight the Aya Cthulhu and win, it drops probably one of the best items that will help us so much in this playthrough. And that's called the Shield of Cthulhu. So, let's, um, I'm gonna end it here though, guys, and we'll see next time if we can actually take it on. But otherwise, guys, I hope you enjoyed today's episode. As I hit my mic, I'm sorry. I hope you enjoyed today's episode. Be sure to hit like on the video. Get subscribed down below. We just crossed 600 subscribers, and we're on our way to 700. Let's try and get there before the end of this month, if we can. That'd be epic. Um, but otherwise, guys, I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye now.